Welcome back guys to another PvP build for the Lost Death DLC. I'm on my Stamina Night build this time with a let's say one VX build, a double bow build, front bar Red Mountain, the Overland Proxit since Kalurin got nerfed by a lot. Red Mountain is probably the best Proxit so far. It deals a ton of damage, has only one second delay and eight seconds cooldown. Really strong. Back bar, Rallying Cry, for a ton of crit resistance and weapon damage, still the best back bar set. Combined with the mythic item, Talk of Tonal, which gives a lot of stamina or magicka region. Combined with Trainee and Blood Spawn as monster set. I did also some tests with Way of Fire instead of Red Mountain. Works also really good, the problem about this set is, it's an heavy armor set combined with Red and Cry, so we would only have three medium armor pieces at max, which means we could not use the medium armor skill Elude, which gives us major evasion. I've tested it without it, and I was way more squishy without 20% AoE damage reduction. I'm on five medium armor pieces, one heavy chest for max resistance, and one light armor sash with six well-fitted pieces and one sturdy full infused on the jewelry with two weapon damage enchantments and one magica region why magica region simple i'm using the savagery potions with savagery stamina and hp so the magica region and sustain is missing because i use conceit weapon Instead of Camouflage Hunter, Conceit Weapon gives now a flat damage bonus by 10% when you leave Sneak, Visibility or Mage Expedition while in combat. Really powerful. And on top, even Minor Expedition just slotted. Then Front Bar Bow in Sharpened with the Flame Damage Enchant and Back Bar Bow in Defending with the Berserker Enchant. Skills, Magnum Shot, SEC. A really powerful knockback, super annoying to play against. Then Conceit Weapon, like I said, just slotted for the flat 10% extra damage and Mine Expedition. Focused Aim, our spammable, which gives Minor Breach, almost 3k armor penetration, really strong. Relentless Focus for Assassin Scorch, and on top the 10% extra crit damage, thanks to Hammer Rage. Shadow Disguise, our Cloak ability, and as Aggressive Ultimate, Toxic Barrage. Look at the tooltip by the way, it's unbuffed. Back bar, Venom Arrow, for the Major Brutality buff. A Loot, for Mage Evasion. Vigor, a Selfie, gives now Minor Resolve 2, 3k extra armor for 20 seconds. Leeching Strikes, just for sustain. Then Percy Mark, for Major Breach, almost 6k armor penetration. And it also marks enemy night blades, so they can't cloak for 3 seconds. As defensive ultimate, still soul siphon, a really powerful burst here. If you're under pressure, press it. The problem with this skill is the cast time, 0.5 seconds. Better option would be probably temporal guard, the psychic ultimate. Ray still arc for weapon spell damage, health and max stamina. Other choices like Khajiit, Wood Elf, Dunmore or even a Pyro should be possible too. Then Mundus the Warrior for extra weapon damage. Lava Food Soup as buff food for max stamina and stamina region. 41 points in health and the rest in stamina. I'm not a vampire. I was a vampire before. I've tested for a couple of hours and it was terrible. The sustain was terrible. I had to change two weapon damage glyphs to stamina or prismatic region glyphs. In my opinion, and not worth the 300 weapon spell damage plus the undeath passive. So it's up to you. Potions, three different potions. For the maximum damage, go with the savagery potions here for the 12% crit rate. Then the twice the potions in one reaction situation, so if you're under pressure. Or the detection potions against other knife blades. Really helpful. CPs, Daddy Aim, Master Dumps, I'm Cat and Doing Sweep Buff. Red Runs the Simple Suffering, Pain's Refuge, Celerity, and Slippery. 
quick talk about one PvP combination. There are many, many here, but I will just show you one. Start always with Piercing Mark for Major Breach and Venom Arrow for Major Brutality, your buffs. Then start with Lethal Arrow into Magnum Shot into Toxic Barrage. Pretty simple and effective combination. Let me show you another one without the ultimate. Piercing Mark, Venom Arrow, Lethal Arrow into Magnum Shot into Assassin Scorch. I'll leave you with the gameplay footage. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and I'll see you hopefully in the next video. Peace.
wonder at our place in the stars. This is the world you've made yourself. Now you have to live in it. The end is in our sights. The future is already here. No matter how hard we tried, we are doomed. Say you goodbye. Brace yourself. I can see the end inside. Three, two, one, hardwired.